I live and work as an artist at the edge of a Cambridgeshire Fenland town, Littleport. I created the Woodfen Labyrinth as an expression of finding my pathway through 2020, this extraordinary year of the COVID-19 pandemic. I walked it regularly as a way of staying in touch with the changing seasons and community. I invited people to make use of the pathway as a shared resource, a safe open space to meet for recreation and exercise. My allotment is also on the edge of town, where traditional growing activities take place for vegetables and flowers. This year the allotment has been a good place to greet neighbours, to see life and the natural world thrive. I planted willow on mine 20 years ago with a plan to make sculpture and basket. I maintain the tradition of using materials grown locally. Harvesting is done in winter when the trees are dormant. The dry willow is soaked in tanks of water filled from rainwater tanks. I make baskets with techniques that have been used for generations. I'm glad to have learnt skills that help me understand the life of basket makers and growers of the past. In particular, a unique one from Prick Willow that was used for taking flowers to market. It is still a perfect design for harvesting and carrying flowers and vegetables. My workshop is my allotment shed. My hands and simple hand tools are all I need to use. My shed is full of work in progress and bundles of willow waiting to be used either by me or for teaching in workshops. If someone wants to learn from me, I'm always happy to pass on the basket making skills. I spend a lot of time grading, selecting and counting sticks. It would have been the job of an apprentice in the past. As I learnt more and worked with larger trees, I developed techniques to use the willow bark. It is like leather when fresh stripped from large branches, but becomes set into the form that the skilled basket maker desires. I will continue making as long as my hands allow, and there are always new techniques to learn.